Oh, see that bird up ahead? It's a rare greater roadrunner. They can run like the wind. Ooh, I want to get a shot of him. <laughs> hey, George, wait up! Good. Mm, it sure does. Water is important for the animals here, too. And finding sources of it is one of the most important things for animals and plants to do in the desert. They probably love the waterfall we're heading to. George, next time a speedy bird challenges you to a foot race in a hot desert, say no, okay? Waterfall is this way. Good thing we brought these jackets. It's really cooling off. Hmm, seems odd. We should have been at the waterfall a while ago. Did we take a wrong turn or something? Yep, we definitely took a wrong turn or something. Hmm. Let's refuel and figure it out. Oh, well. I guess I can take meteor shower photos without that gorgeous waterfall backdrop. A bit disappointing, but no big deal. Kangaroo rats. Yep, they look like little kangaroos. They must have slept all day and are now looking for water. <laughs> That's nice of you, George, but it's best to let them find water on their own. Ah, oh, well, I'm tuckered. <laughs> wow. Not over a waterfall, but still pretty magnificent. <gasps> wow. A desert bighorn sheep. Those meteors. Magical. <laughs> Professor Wiseman said the kangaroo rats were looking for water. Maybe the sheep were too. <gasps> Glad to see you love the meteor shower too. Magnificent stuff. <laughs> That's right, George. The sheep were probably on their way to get water. At the waterfall. Follow those sheep. Which way did they go? <laughs> Beautiful. George, you used what you learned about desert animals to help us find our way. Fantastic. Yes, great powers of observation. Ah, <laughs> George only had one animal left to find. 